this is Stacey Dye from Pacific Magazine and Berkeley Film Friends, and we are here on the press line for Joshi. Can you tell me about your role in the movie? Yes, uh, the movie's called Joshi, and I play the role of Josh. Nice. I'm one of the guys who goes on the Joshi characters' uh, aborted, disastrous Bachelor weekend. Yeah. And I'm like the stick in the mud. Yeah, so you're the one that doesn't want to have fun, that kind yeah. of guy? Yeah. yeah. I think my idea of fun is sort of lambasted roundly in the movie. I play Greg. I play Greg. But I'm weird. Nice. Very cool. I like it. Uh, yeah. Yeah. You know, he's, he, uh, I am Nick's character's friend, Nick Roll char character's yeah. friend, and I show, I kind of crash the party. Oh, got you, got everybody you. Everybody doesn't really totally know what I'm about. I play Jody. Um, she's a woman who is in Ojai for her 30th birthday and ends up spending a bit of her weekend with uh, these men instead. My character is a friend of uh, Josh's, Thomas Middleditch's character, yeah. uh, who lives with him, and so, and he's a little bit of an agent, I'm an agent of uh, of like uh, momentum. Yeah. I'm a catalyst for yeah. not necessarily the best uh, things happening, but uh, he's trying to keep the he's trying to keep the weekend moving. Nice. And nice. not everybody's on board with that. Any fun set stories? Anything funny happen? I mean, it was kind of perpetually funny. I mean, it yeah. was just like a bunch of uh, comedians essentially yeah. stuck in a house. I had sex with a donkey. Did you really? Yeah. Like on the down low for real? We're we getting was the not scoop? on the down low. It was yeah. at the rap party, and they brought a donkey, and I had sex with it. And it had sex with me. Wow. And I, afterwards yeah. I felt like, was that weird? And like the next day everyone was like cool about it, but it seemed like people were a little weirded a little out by weirded it. Out, yeah. But like whatever, I just yeah. wanted to let loose and have fun. It's just really weird being the one woman living with all of these men and yeah. like having your period. Oh, yeah. yeah. I feel you. That's I feel you. Yeah. yeah. Although it's very empowering because like yeah. you're doing the same work that they're doing, yeah. but you know that, you know, the lower half of your body feels <laughs> like it's filled with knives. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's cool. Yeah. I mean, it, it, it was really nice. I, I, we've all known each other for so long, so it was great to like just kind of hunker down and camp and yeah. you know we were all in Ojai and making a movie it couldn't yeah. have been better we're all college students from UC Berkeley and wondering if you have any advice for college students who want to get into the film industry well god you guys have so much access now because there's yeah. it's so easy to make your own thing yeah uh, and That's I would oh yeah. yeah I mean when I went to school that didn't exist you really needed a film camera and film which was expensive and editing bays which were expensive so yeah. I think it's a really wonderful time to be a young wannabe filmmaker yeah. or a person in a film because yeah. it's it, there's just every chance that you can do it yourself and get it seen I think if you want to get into a creative profession you, you really have to um, you really have to have a good strong brain it's not about the specifics, it's about uh, learning how to break down a narrative, uh, develop your tastes. If you want to enter an industry, you should know why you want to be there and what you like. And, uh, and also, uh, don't take yourself too seriously, because um, it's all supposed to be fun, it's art. Be aggressive, uh, yeah. failure is part of it, heartache and disappointment is part of it. Yeah. Don't let that sway you, the business, the, the, yeah. the business demands moxie out of you, yeah. so give it to them.